Yeah, rainy day activities. It's raining and snowing outside. Good day to do repairs. Yeah, that's not a canoe or a kayak. That's a catamaran pontoon. There's uh, Jim Henry's old typhoon, now owned by John Jameson. And it needs some uh, TLC to get back on the water. She's seen a lot of downriver nationals and such taking its toll, but we'll put it back together. I think uh, both myself and Dana Henry have had a hand in crunching the bow on this boat. Uh, let's see, what's up here? We've got an old 17 foot duck hunter. That needs new all, all new rails. Let's see, we got an old Stowe Mansfield getting some new rails. Here's another old 17 foot explorer, needs some rails. Lives on the Cape. Let's see, here's a Vermont canoe. She needs a little uh, freshening up on the gunnels. There's a one of a kind, a black Kevlar Mad River Explorer that was made specifically for the McKechnie family. Those of you in the composites world may know the McKechnies. Let's see. Oh, right here? What's this? Oh, this poor 99 Explorer Royal X. Got some coal cracks. Let's see, getting ready to work on those. Little zoom in. Exciting stuff for those of you who uh, are into this stuff. For those of you who aren't, well, I guess it's kind of boring. What else? Wood's starting to rot, but he doesn't want to do anything about that yet. Let's see, down here, we've got rotten rail. We're going to do a splice at the end here. Needs a little fixing up in there. Should get skid plates, but they're not going to do that yet. Let's see. Oh, here's a poor little thing. Here's a Current Designs Kestrel 120. Brand new. Owners bought one for him and one for her. They got home. He got his in the garage. Went to get hers off the car. Took off the straps and the wind took it. Took it for a ride and smashed the V up here in the hull near the bow. Patches on the inside. Just finished all the dremeling. Gonna put in the gel coat today and it's gonna be some serious wet sanding. Oh, how I love wet sanding. And there's some damage down there. Let's see, what's here? Oh, there's the original wood strip for the Tupper of Robbie Fournette design and fame. Here is a Kevlar Explorer smashed up. And I think on the Saco River, the aluminum gunnels are bent, waiting to get some of those out of confluence. Then we've got to do some Kevlar patching on the inside and some gel coat work. Here's an old fiberglass Mad River Winooski. It's got all new gunnels, slotted gunnels. Came out nice, going to go home to New Jersey soon. Let's see what's down here. Oh, here's a Bell Bucktail that, as the customer put it, got crushed like a grape by winter snow load. The damage is in the back on the behind the seat. I'm gonna do a whole bunch of patchwork. Skin coat, so we'll just skim a little resin on the outside. No gel coat work there. And let's see. Maybe we can see out the window. There's a whole bunch more boats out there that need work. Um, hate to see them come in damaged, but it's one way we make a living is Making them better. So everybody, think spring. It'll get here eventually. I know I'm looking forward to some fair weathered paddling. Uh, if your boat needs some TLC, you got questions, give us a call. And hopefully we'll see you on the water. Later, bye.